And, and you also mentioned that amputees got a choice. And this is sort of like um, the, the other point that I kind of wondered about of, obviously I can see what, if you have just a small, small injury on your body and you didn't have an amputation, you could work as a teamster or you could work in the hospital. Mm -hmm. But what would an uh, amputee do, especially if they had like lower limb, like a leg amputation? Yeah, I mean, they have these guys doing a wide variety of stuff. They are clerking, they're working mm. in, you know, um, as as you mentioned, there's, or I should say, as I mentioned before, there's two battalions that they split them up into. So mm -hmm. first battalion is men who are more physically able. Mm -hmm. And they kind of just, they kind of split that by saying that they're capable of bearing arms. So they could carry a rifle. Mm -hmm. And so those guys sometimes actually do get into scrapes. Like they are, um, they are used in the response to the draft riots in New York City. They get into a little scuffle outside of Washington, D.C., um, I think in 1864. Yeah, but then, yeah, exactly, right. Mm -hmm. um, and, but then 2nd Battalion kind of fills in all of the, um, sort of the, other things that you need to have done to keep the army running smoothly, but that doesn't involve, you know, ditch digging or fighting on the front lines, right? So they're doing a lot of like, I don't know, kind of like what we would think of as white collar type mm -hmm. job. They're doing a lot of clerking, um, those at hospital stewards, mm -hmm. all sorts of different things. Almost like you want to think of like the Spielberg's Lincoln movie and be like, maybe all the guys in that telegraph office should have been in yeah. some form injured instead of looking like healthy individuals. Right, exactly. Yeah. So, um, and that's kind of how they're thinking too, is like, yeah. why use someone who is capable of shouldering arms and marching mm -hmm. to, yeah. you know, write out paperwork when we can have this guy who, you know, he's missing a lower limb and so he's going to need to sit, but he can write, you know. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Uh.